Hey everybody, this is Christina DeJanay and today I'm going to be talking to you about my internship experience at Dominion Energy. For summer 2018 and summer 2019, I interned in the Petersburg office of Dominion Energy and I was a electric distribution design intern. I'll be talking about things like my interview, orientation, the perks of being an intern at Dominion, what a typical day is like, and just things that you had to do as an intern. If you want to hear more about those things, then stay here and let's get into the video. First, I'm gonna talk about how I found out about the internship and what my interview was like. I found out about the internship through Virginia State University, and that's where I go. I'm a senior manufacturing engineering major. I'm about to graduate, thank the Lord. But, <laughs> but I found out about the internship through email. My school is really good about sending emails about opportunities, internships, job offers, all that type of stuff. So I saw the email and it was talking about the internship itself, you can be any major, and it was talking about that they have diversity scholarships available. I went on the website and applied. I had to write a paper for the diversity scholarship. The diversity scholarship was $5,000, and that was even more. That's just another reason why I wanted to sign up because that will really help. Along with the paper that I had to write for the scholarship, you had to turn in just regular stuff that you usually do, so like resume, your transcript, all that stuff. About two months or so later I got a phone call interview and in the spring they asked me to come back for an in-person interview I'm not gonna lie the in-person interview was a little intimidating because it was four people in there I was already nervous so yeah but the interview itself it wasn't too bad I just made sure that I studied the company itself. I studied their core values. They are very serious about their core values. The main questions that they asked were situational questions. So they didn't really ask me any questions about Dominion Energy itself or anything like that. It was like, what would you do in this situation or what have you done in this in a situation like this or something? The next like thing I'm going to talk about is orientation. So orientation is pretty much when all the interns come together. You get to meet everybody for the first time. Sometimes people come back from multiple years like I did. There was someone that was there for three years, three or four years, because you can do the internship as a graduate student too. So that's pretty cool. Orientation is pretty much where you do workshops. You get to meet the different people, like I said. You get to meet executives. They give you goodie bags. There's always good food every year. The food has always been really good. Actually, any event Dominion puts on, the food has been really good. The executives, they just talk about their experience at Dominion. They talk about struggles. They talk about when they first came to Dominion, their education, just a whole bunch of things, and we get to ask them questions. The next thing I'm gonna talk about is the perks of being an intern at Dominion. So the first thing is that you get paid every two weeks and you can do flex schedule. I personally didn't do that during my internship, now that I look back at it, I wish I did because other interns did and they were off sometimes. So I was like, how y'all off? And then it would be like, we did flex. And I was like, Phew. the next thing is during your internship, you get to visit other jobs. So you, you don't have to stay in your office all day. You can ask your manager to visit other jobs. So if you're interested, so I was in electric distribution design, but if I was interested in accounting or somewhere else, then I could ask the manager and then the manager would set it up and then one day I would just go for a full day somewhere else or half a day somewhere else and throughout my whole internship experience the last two summers I did a lot of visiting and it was a good experience some things I visited and I was like mm -mm. and then some things I visited and I was like "Ooh, maybe I could do this I really like this it's good because you can get a bigger point of view of the company and see what the whole company does. Now I see why Dominion says we accept all majors because they literally have everything at Dominion. This tree is blocking my sun, but it's okay. Oh, coming back. The next thing is you can get a housing stipend. So if you live far enough away from your office and you have to move up there, you can get a housing stipend. The next thing is 
you can get reimbursed for gas money. So if Dominion makes you drive or go out of your way from your office for whatever reason, if they have an event somewhere that you're required to go to or something like that, you can put in the system um, on your computer and they'll reimburse you the money that you had to use for gas. The next perk is internship events. So Dominion for interns, they have a whole bunch of events that you can go to and pretty much they have this system on the computer where you can sign up um, until all the slots are gone. So they have plant tours, they have events, more laid back events like going bowling with the other interns or going to a arcade with interns and they provide the food and everything. So it's really cool and you get to hang out. That's another perk as well. You get to meet people from pretty much around the country, honestly. To this day, I still talk to some of the friends I met at my internship. Another thing is most of the time throughout your internship, you will at least meet Mr. Farrell once, and that's the CEO of Dominion Energy and any other big executives. And it's funny because some of <laughs> some of my coworkers, they would come back and be like, they have y'all doing all this stuff. We never met them before. Or like, no, so you get to do stuff that regular people within the company don't really ever get to do. Another perk, well, at least for my job in electric distribution, you get to, what they call it is dress for your day. So you don't have to wear business all the time. What I honestly wore was I wore jeans and a nice shirt or I wore black pants and a nice shirt or khakis and a nice shirt. Especially if I knew I was going out in the field that day, I would put jeans on because you don't want to get good pants dirty. I do like business attire, like that's one of my favorite things, but I don't like to do it all the time. So that was pretty cool to just be able to relax. Another one is the volunteer days. So personally, I like volunteering and if you don't like volunteering, okay, but they make it fun. So every year the interns have a volunteer day. The first year I interned, it was, we cleaned up Bell Isle. I actually have a YouTube video on my channel about all that. And I have some stuff from Dominion, so if you wanna go back and look at that video too, you can. The first year was clean up Bell Isle, and the second year was clean up downtown Richmond. And pretty much both years, they split us up into teams, and whoever came back with the most trash or cool trash won. So it was fun because it was another way we got to hang out with our fellow interns, and it was just fun. We were outside, and yeah. So as you can see, I like being outside most of the time. Another perk of being a Dominion Energy intern is that when you do good in your first internship or whatever, you will most likely be invited back for another one unless something happened or you couldn't. And I'm not saying it's guaranteed, but most likely, like more than likely, you'll be invited back for another one. So when you do your internship, you wanna make sure that you're doing everything you're supposed to do, you come to work on time and things like that because you wanna get a good review so that you can be invited back next year. So for me, I started in summer 2018, then I was invited back for summer 2019, and then after that, I was offered a job offer. Just do good. <laughs> the last perk about being an intern is Dominion Energy Family Fun Days. And Dominion, they have a list of things you can do every year so if you live in virginia you know about bush gardens king's dominion water country um so like amusement parks they have baseball games up there and things like that and you can go through the list and pick pick what you want and then you get free tickets so you can go with your family and friends to whatever you want to go to and um i went to bush gardens and it was really cool because I had the Diversity Scholarship, I was a part of a group called Diversity Scholars. And I was a part of that both years of my internship. Diversity Scholars, they have to go to a week called Diversity Scholarship Week or Diversity Week or something like that. And it's a week where you go through workshops, people come in and talk to you, and there's a theme every year. The first year, I believe the theme, it was pretty general. It was just like, how can we improve diversity at Dominion? 
And then the second year was the theme was nonprofits and how these nonprofits help communities within Richmond. At these workshops, they feed you every day, you do different activities, and at the end of the whole thing, both years, you have to present something. They split you up into groups, and it really helped with my public speaking because sometimes I do get shy and I do want to get better with public speaking and not stumbling over my words and stuff. And both years, I could say that I did get better and better. It also was a way for me to present something in front of executives. Next, I'm going to talk about what my typical day was like at Dominion. But my typical day was pretty much I worked from 8 a.m. to 4.30. I would come in and I had a mentor that I shadowed a lot. And I would either, if I had a list of things to do on my desk or they would need me to do, then I would do that. But if I didn't have anything that day, then I would go shadow him. Some days were slow and some days were fast. The main thing that I did was I worked down jobs on this program called WEMIS. And pretty much that's when jobs come in, people call into the customer service, then customer service passes it to us. And then we pass it off to construction and then yeah that and then the job gets done and that's how that pretty much works the process of learning how to work down jobs and women's it i wouldn't say it was hard but it had a lot of moving parts to it and you had to remember stuff so i would have all these like sticky notes on my desk to make sure don't don't forget to do this don't forget to do that some days a lot of jobs up to like a hundred jobs will come in literally and then some days no jobs will come in if it was a day where I went to shadow my mentor sometimes he would sit at the desk and work on his jobs there and then sometimes he would have to go out in the field and what go out in the field means is he would have to take notes of what he was working on so he had to take notes of how high the power line is whether it was underground or overhead lines or measure how far the the line is from the transformer or the house is from the transformer or whatever the case may be but he has to take those notes so then he so he can take it back to the office and then work on his job from there and then he passes it off to his manager and then the manager checks it off and then he can like I said before then he can pass it to construction and then the job gets done as a senior the last thing that you're gonna have to do is do a senior report out and what a senior report out is is you're gonna have to make a presentation about all the things you've done during your internship and present it to executives and just pitch as to why you think you should work at Dominion this really helped with my public speaking as well get in the butterflies to go away speaking in front of people because it was the executives and then other people watching your presentation. So other kids were doing their senior report outs too. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment down below. Share with a friend. Comment down below any of your internship experiences or what companies y'all are interning at or if you have any questions about Dominion Energy. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.